Hey, what's up guys? Bajira here. Really exciting news for you guys. Once again, we have a brand new Bajira Warrior Pride themed t-shirts available for sale on Teespring right now until August 24th. This design is absolutely beast. Shows off your warrior power, your warrior pride, and I hope that you guys like it too. These shirts are available in men's, women's, and hoodies sizing. So be sure to act now until August 24th to pick yours up. Thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoy the video and I hope you enjoy the t-shirts. All right, guys, so this is going to be a video about my physique progress three weeks out from my competition. And the funny thing about this video is that we had to wake up really, really early today for a documentary shoot about gaming and sort of how it has affected our lives and enriched our lives. Because gaming is, after all, about more than just sort of beating a level or, uh, you know, accomplishing an objective within the game. You know, it's, it's, a, it's become a platform for us to share a lot of positivity and a lot of cool things uh, in our life. Like the fitness, so we had to wake up really, really early for that. So this fitness progress update video is done at about 6 in the morning for me. Uh, <laughs> just decided to do a little bit of posing, practice in the morning to get warmed up. Uh, and ended up taking today uh, as like the first day kind of off of a workout in months. So today was one of my refeed days, and really we've been kicking a lot of butt. Working really, really hard across a lot of different platforms, you know, doing the arena commentary. Uh, we did awesome with that. Like I said, we were doing a documentary filming today as well. Uh, definitely have been kicking butt with the videos and streams. So everything has been going really, really well. And I'm really, really happy. In addition to, you know, definitely putting in a lot of work with my physique. So everything's been going great. But today was the first day in a long time that I decided to give myself a little bit of rest. But before I did that, like I said, uh, I wanted to do a little bit of posing practice. And if I'm going to be doing posing practice uh, at my house, you know, first thing in the morning, why not share a little bit of that with you guys? Since we are three weeks away from my second physique show. And I think that taking a look at where I am right now, really not with much of a pump to speak of. Didn't do any really any uh, high carbohydrate, really. or uh, I had my refeed on Sunday, and this was Tuesday. Um, but I didn't really have a lot of carbs before this or anything like that. You know, no water depletion, like I said, so... Uh, really? Just have, having a look at, at how I look when I wake up at 6 in the morning, so that's pretty cool. Honestly, I do feel like just to, just taking a look at how I look this in this video versus how I look a lot of mornings, I feel like I look even a little bit more uh, watery and soft than, uh, than I normally do. So that's pretty cool, because that means that as we continue to dial it in for the next three weeks, we're going to only get better and better. Uh, today, like I said, I did do another refeed day. Uh, I hung out with my parents on Sunday. We had some sushi, then I had some cereal after that. So I definitely had um, uh, a good amount of calories, but I just didn't feel like I had quite filled out. Like I said, I was looking a little bit watery, but watery is different, you know? Like a lot of times when I get a refeed and I hit it right, I feel fuller, but then I'm also a little bit drier and also more vascular. So I decided to get a little bit more carbs in uh, today because today, like I said, is about three weeks away from my show. And uh, during this three weeks, I'm really going to hammer it. I will be a little bit more, uh, I will be diligent about getting in carbohydrates and refeeding and whatnot because I still do think I have a little bit of body fat to lose, but uh, maybe not maybe not too much uh, to lose in the next three weeks. I mean, I could always get leaner um, overall, but that, that's going to probably be a, a goal for the next, the next time I diet down. I think that the physique that I have here is about what we're going to be bringing to the competition in terms of the muscle mass, in terms of mostly, you know, the body fat loss. Like I said, whenever we uh, uh, prepare for the physique competition, actually, like the day of before or whatever, we'll get some more carbs in, but I'll also bring my water down just a little bit so that we can dry out and, and just look our absolute best on the day of the show. Nothing too crazy, just just pretty much standard practice for me. I don't go into any sort of um, extreme water depletion or no, no real extreme sodium depletion or anything like that, or no extreme carbohydrate loading. I just kind of bring my carbs up a little bit, bring my water down a little bit, don't worry too much about my sodium, and just go in the go into the show feeling good and looking good. So three weeks out, I feel like uh, we've done some really good work, and I'm really, really proud of where we are. Uh, I'm also going to mess around here and just play a little bit and hit some hit some more bodybuilding style poses. You don't really do any of these like side chests for the physique. Maybe the main thing for me with the physique is just that front pose and that back pose. It's pretty much like the front relaxed, back relaxed, and that's that's the goal here. So I did, I did a little bit of that posing practice, but I said, hey, this is a physique progress update, three weeks out. You know, my physique's looking good. Let's uh, let's do some bodybuilding poses just to sort of 
uh, for the record, right, and have some fun. So overall, I feel like I'm, I'm doing a good job. I know these last three weeks will be um, definitely some three, some intense three weeks of uh, dieting and training. Uh, I remember last time I was three weeks out, I, I feel like I made a lot of progress. Uh, even though it was only three weeks, I feel like I really did a good job with my training, really did a good job with my dieting, and made a lot of progress in that three weeks, and ended up having a really, really solid three weeks of training and dieting leading up to my show, and felt great on show day as well. So if I can repeat that performance, I'm going to be really, really happy. And uh, today was probably my last like big refeed. You know, I, I, I do like cereal, but I'm going to probably cut out the dairy and the sugar uh, of cereal, you know, three weeks to go. And that's fine. I mean, I can definitely handle that. The, the cereal is fun because it does have the sugar, uh, complex carbohydrates, you know, a little bit of salt in there too. So it's just kind of a fun thing to refeed with, plus it tastes good for me personally. But I'm probably going to start cleaning it up a little bit with my refeeds. Maybe start sticking to more like rice. Uh, just sort of adding more rice into my normal meals will probably be like my refeed day. That's really all I'll do. Uh, and that's fine with me because that's been working for me in the past. Just keeping things a little bit cleaner leading up to the show. But I did want to show you guys, you know, how, I, how my physique was looking three weeks out. Don't be surprised if you see more physique updates over the next couple weeks. Just leading up to it because I want to take inventory of how I'm doing. But I'll also be doing lots of posing practice. And it's fun to record that just to look back on it and make improvements. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support, and I will see you guys next time. Peace!